Now let's see the problem with the classroom. We got 15 boys and 10 girls. Three students are selected at random. So the word keyword random is really important. The probability that one girl and two boys are selected is these are the options. We got 15 boys and 10 girls. I need to pick only two boys and one girl. So I need to find the probability. So as he told, I got 15 boys and 10 girls. The number of sample space of our selecting 3 out of 5 is 25C3. I need to identify the number of possible events. One girl out. So the number of girls is 10. 10 C1. And 15 C2 for boys. The total number is 25. So 25 C3. This is a probability. As indicated, the sample space is NCR equal to N factorial divided by R factorial into N minus R factorial. Anyone is the possibility. That's why we got this formula to be implemented. As I told, 25 C3, which will have 25 dollar, it's factorial, 3 factorial into 25 minus 3 factorial. So it's 25 factorial into 23 factorial, so 22 into 3 factorial. We got 25, 24, 23 and 3 into 2 into 3. So telling this one, you got 2300. That's the possible space. If you talk about the number of events, 10 C1 into 10, 15 C2, that's 10 factorial divided by 9 factorial into 15 factorial into 2 into 3, 13 factorial. Solving this one, you got 5 into 15 into 14. We got 1050. The probability is the number of events divided by number of sample space. 1050 divided by 2300. You got 25 divided by 46. That's the answer. We will move to the pack of cards. We got 52 cards in a pack. Two cards are taken at random. What is the probability of both the cards being the king? That's a question. So this is the 52 cards in a pack. And the possibility of being the king. So the possibility, the number of sample space is two cards you are selecting. So we got the find the number of sample space 52 C2 we need to make it out because the keyword random is there. The keyword random is there you have to use this combination C. This is a formula. And now you need to find the number of events for selecting it. So we got four kings here. Among four kings I want only two kings. So 4 C2 is the combination and afterwards you need to find the probability. Moving further, we got our sample space as 52C2. So n factorial divided by r factorial n minus r factorial that's 52 into 51 into 50 factorial divided by 2 into 50 factorial. So this one will be tally and you got 52 into 51 divided by 2, that's 1326. The possibility of getting 2 kings out of 4, that's 4 factorial divided by 2 into 2 factorial, that's 4 into 3 into 2 factorial, divided by 2 factorial into 2 factorial, you got 4 into 3 divided by 2, that's 6. So the option is number of possible events. Divided by number of sample space, that's 6, divided by 1326, the answer is 1 divided by 221.